Hey everybody, how's it going? Clayton back here today with another video. You can also call me Gold Bear if you like. But uh, today guys, I am celebrating 100 subscribers. Yes, I finally made it to my goal. For the past two years, I've been doing YouTube and I've always wanted to get to 100 subscribers. That was my main goal and I finally got to it. So uh, yeah. Now the new goal is trying to get to 130 subscribers, so let's see if we can do that. Um, we don't have to do it by the end of this month or the end of January, but let's get to 130 subscribers. We got to. So anyways guys, in, uh, in with that, I am going to be giving you guys a room tour of basically my whole room. But basically, I'm going to turn on the light so you guys can actually see everything. I got some stuff hidden because spoilers to the series. So yeah, let's do this. Okay guys, we're going to start over here with the room tour. Here is my Bendy display slash showdown bandit. I'm still working on it, you know, got the action figures up and everything, well, kind of up. Um, I'm going to try doing a section where I got just Bendy and the Ink Machine and then Bendy and the Dark Revival, but that's going to come very soon. Um, not much up here, just a box with more Bendy stuff in it. Um, coming over here, you know, just miscellaneous, there's my McFarlane slash Funko. Um, over here you can see all the boxes, I haven't had places to put them, so I just put them on the shelf. Back we got some FNAF, so Bendy FNAF. Over here we got some brand new action figures that are going to be reviewed pretty soon. Over right here we got the brand new Ink Demon slash Ink Bendy, and then the brand new Ink Slime Machine that came out, so that is pretty cool. Moving on. Just got some Legos and stuff. Got my ATST, I think that's what it's called. And then, you know, I know this is the AT Walker and then this is the ATST. But, uh, got my custom Markiplier that kind of sucks. We got four wheeler. Yeah, I just got a whole bunch of miscellaneous Lego on the shelf. And then got some of that Star Wars and Packers. Here's my Lego train right here. Got it on I actually got it on the tracks now for just display. And then in the back we got this more Lego stuff that you know I really don't show on the channel that often. So yeah. Moving on down here, I got my kind of like just other McFarland sets that I don't really put up in like the shelves that like up by my um, FNAF ones, but here we got some Rick and Morty sets going on here, so that is cool. Um, we got some South Park um, set, or one of the South Park sets right there. So yeah. Then down below we got some Fortnite kind of jazzware stuff going on here. Uh, this is kind of also miscellaneous, I really don't do much with this stuff, I kind of just have it here. I'm more collecting the Fortnite McFarlane uh, action figures, but these are just ones I picked up before I, uh, you know, got the McFarlane ones. But, uh, you know, this one came from the Loot Llama, also with this and a bag of, or no, not a bag, but like all this other loot, so that's pretty cool. So, yeah, just put that back there and this guy back up and uh yeah moving on to the next shelf we got my golden freddy head here i'll take the hats off of it so you can see a full thing of it here's golden freddy i made that so that is pretty cool um hopefully those hats stay up there um over here we got my lego bb8 uh, I got that last year for with my birthday money. That was 80 bucks. <laughs> Wait, no, I didn't get that last year. I got that the year before. But uh, yeah, I got that with some birthday money. Over here, we got some more Legos. Got my Las Vegas and then my London. 
Got some clay projects I made, like this Samurai Foxy I made. My deformed pumpkin, and whatever this is. Then I got some more Legos right here. And then moving on, I got my sculpture, got some more FNAF, my mystery mini collection, some Cuphead Funko, some more Lego. Then we got the Fortnite McFarlane toys, action figures. I got the glider. I also got the Loot Llama. So that is pretty cool. Um, also got some of these FNAF posters over here. Got a Nightmare of Foxy and then Nightmare for a oh while. Wow. This is kind of a mix of Freddy and Nightmare Freddy kind of combined, so that's something. We got the plush tuber wall right here. There's me right there. Aiden Moon Studios, Techno, Peachy Production, Super Laser Guy, and that's it for now. I'm going to be adding more soon. But uh, yeah, Techno Fox, if I put his full name in there. And last but not least, my FNAF McFarlane waves. And, uh, and some Funko, but I just want to say something about the McFarlane FNAF waves. I have been collecting these waves for at least, th at least three to four years now, and I've gotten a lot of them um, over the past like couple of years. So there's a lot to go through. I ain't going to be going through a full tour, but I probably will do that short sometime after Christmas if I can. But, um, yeah, let's get to it. So, you know, we got the show stage, and I'm not going to show every, well, I'm not going to say every set, but I'm up close with these ones. So, we got uh, the office with Golden Freddy, um, Ro or not Rockstar, uh, Foxy with Pirates Cove. We got West Hall, getting East Hall very soon, hopefully. Parts and Service, we got some FNAF 3 going on here. FNAF 2, got some action figures as well, so yeah, got my plushie up there, and then I got my Freddy Pop, I got little bit, got some stickers, got some more, <laughs> more Funko, and then McFarlane boxes, here's the whole Wave 2 of the 8-bit collection, so that's cool. And then going all the way down, which I'm going to try to see if I can get a good look at the FNAF 2 wave. We got Mango, toy, the toy stage, the game area, some other sets, got Shadow Bonnie, Golden Freddy, got some other sets in the back there, going down the FNAF 4. And then all the way down to Sister Location, which I have almost every set from. I have every set from at least Wave 1, Wave 3, Wave 4, and Wave 5. Now, I, I need to get some sets from Wave 2, but those will be coming. Well, I'm hopefully I'm going to get them soon if I can and find them, but who knows? But, um... There you go guys, there's a whole room tour of what's been or what I've been collecting for the past two to three, four years now. Um, it's just amazing of everything I've gotten in the past, you know. It's very cool to just look back at it and just be like, you know, this is what I've been doing. This is what I've been entertaining people with, my collection and everything, you know. Like, like stuff like that, Funko Pops. I, I haven't even shown those on the, the uh, room tour yet. Got those. Um, got a whole box down there with stuff in it. So, yeah, that's cool. Well, more Funko Pops at least. And then my closet, which is a total, total mess. You can't really see good in there, but there's some stuff. Got some bendy models going in there, but that's for another time. But, um, yeah. Guys, I just want to say that I'm really glad that I've done YouTube because it made, 
it allowed me to have connection with other subscribers and you know meet new people on the internet and everything it's just been a honor to do something so cool on the internet and just you know interact with people and then you know people like other like the same stuff as me and all that you know like the bendy fans out there and the fnaf fans and Fortnite fans and all those fans out there that like something, you know, somebody's a fan of something, as uh, Funko quotes, <laughs> but, uh, you know, it's just been an honor of doing videos for you guys, and I'm ho hopefully going to be doing more uh, anytime soon, well, going to be doing more because Christmas is right around the corner, so, yeah. But I just want to say I'm very thankful for all the support you guys have given me in the past two years. Or if you're new to the channel, thank you. I really love what I'm doing on this platform. It's, it's amazing. I know YouTube has been going through rough times, but I see past that now. I see that YouTube could have a better future. People could do more things on YouTube, you know. Although they want to make it child friendly, and I understand the fact that why, but you know, I just, I don't know what else to say, but thank you guys for being there and supporting me through the past two years, and coming up next year in April will be the third anniversary of the YouTube channel, so I'll probably do another anniversary video. If I can do a live stream, I will, but we'll be another anniversary, and uh, for as long as I keep on uh, reviewing stuff and all this kind of like other stuff, getting stuff in and everything, you know, I'll, I will be doing YouTube for as long as I can, because I really believe that I could make something good out of this, so um, yeah, but anyways guys, Thanks for watching this room tour video. I really thank you all for staying tuned into the videos. It's just, I like to see you guys' comments. They really just make me happy and you know, I like, I like them. Um, so keep commenting in the uh, chats and uh, or in the comments down below. And I will see you guys in the next video. Stay tuned because Bendy merch is coming, FNAF merch is coming, Cuphead stuff is coming, maybe, and lots more. So, you guys, uh, have a good night, and I will see you all in the next video again. So, so yeah, peace. And